Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. Somebody's trying to take this photograph and cut it out as a sticker or for a sticker. Now, for the one I'm doing it for, I reduced it in size a lot. But that way, I, I truly believe Corel doesn't have to work as hard. And he does a couple of things differently than I do because he, I had to change them to a... Um, because he had a feel, so I, I took that away, if, if you notice. But anyway, I've got this thing set. I've got your nudge factor set on 20, so I'm going to make a duplicate. I'm actually going to make a couple of duplicates. I'm going to take this last one. I'm going to go to Trace Bitmap Outline Trace Clip Art. And because we're just using it as a cut line, I'm going to bump the detail all the way up to 100 because it's not going to affect it or shouldn't. So there's our trace version. Now, if you look up here, your uh, bounding box or bounding tool and boundary and weld tool are gone. But if we go to object group and ungroup it, as soon as we do that, this comes up. And I just put a boundary around it. I'm going to go ahead and make it my red. Now, there's <clears throat> a couple of things I don't know how to do, or I know how to do it. I don't know what he wants to do. This part of a sticker would just fall off or, or tear or whatever. So I'm going to make, I'm going to do it a couple of different ways. Uh, probably the easiest thing to do would just be to take a cut line or a freehand tool and draw from there to there and go down here and draw from here to here, blocking off those two pieces. Now take the Smart Fill tool, and I always do it, even though I feel pretty confident. Put a rectangle around it. Grab the Smart Fill tool and fill that in. See, I felt pretty confident it wasn't going to leak. Now that's your new cut line, but it's right on the edge. So we're going to take one of these ones we made originally. And because I've nudged the whole time, I don't have to worry about it not fitting. And there is your graphic. Now it's right on the edge and it's kind of rough. So if I, you know, if I was going to do it, let's make a duplicate of all this and take away the outline. You're going to need a little bit of, uh, you know, if they want a little border on it. They don't want it right on the graphic. And if you do that, you could actually take your, if you have X7 or above, Take the smoothing tool and kind of smooth up this. See that pretty bad. And if you don't have X7 or above, you can do it without. But see how that smoothed it up? Because you don't want, and I'm actually too big, so I'm going really fast. You don't want to, you don't want those rough spots on a sticker. Now, then I would look at it. But so you could use that as a sticker or let's make it well I've got plenty of copies of her maybe and I've never made a sticker but I'm going to take this new cleaner version of it and go to contour effects and contour just one millimeter to the outside and by cleaning up before you contour it uh, when you contour something, and that might be too much. Let's go uh, 0 0.05. No, that's not enough. I can't remember what I did before. There we go, 0 0.5. Then go to object, break contour apart, and grab that outer contour and move it over. That way you have a little buffer. Uh, and I, you know, I don't know if the sticker is going to be white. And see how we've intentionally cut her hair off on those two spots. And you know, if the, um, if the sticker is a blue sticker and which I doubt you would be, that's what it's going to look like. That's what the sticker is going to look like. I most likely think it's going to be white. And, and then that's what it's going to look like on a, when you put it on something, you're going to see that white, um, it almost looks pink. 
That looks like a gray. I must have hit gray. No, it's just, I'm just wondering what color. Um, anyway, that's beside the point. So what I'm saying is, you know, do you want it close or do you want it right on the money? You know, you want it like that. Let me take away this red box. Take away the color. Whoop, took away the outline. I don't know why it won't take away that outline. Or the, there we go. So do you want it like that? Or do you want it like that? Whoop. You want it like this? Or do you want it like that? You want it right on the money? Or do you want to have a little bit of sticker hanging over? Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.